Hello, Fawful Guy here. Um, let's do some more Fire Emblem. Right? Right. I guess. <coughs> <coughs> I gotta get my uh, narration voice ready. Hector and his companions defeat Marquezlas' son, Eric, and seize Castle Laos. After the battle, they rest in the castle and settle their affairs. They diligently prepare for any possible counterattack. They should have spotted anyone attempting to approach the castle. Wait, you mean someone on lookout fail at their job? And yet, somehow, they find themselves facing an unforeseen attack. Eh. Uh. <clears throat> oh jeez. Alright, oh yeah, this coming chapter is exclusive to Hector mode, by the way. I guess. I don't know why. Anyways, Lord Hector, we're under attack. Is it Marquez Laos? He's come back to take the castle? Perfect. We'll catch him easily. No, it's not him. The attackers aren't regular army. They aren't regular army. Don't you mean a regular army? And whatever. The translation can be a bit clunky sometimes. Anyways, maybe they're mercenaries hired by Laos. Mercenaries? Their movements are very rapid. Coordinated. They've already made their way into the castle. For mercenaries, they're very, very good. Yeah. And then I'm gonna check their stats and laugh. Elliewood, do you have any ideas? My father told me something once. There's a mercenary group extremely loyal to House Laos. I mean, are they really a merc group in that case? Well, I mean, I guess they're still getting paid, maybe. Their leader is named Uban Ubans? 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 But he's called the Hurricane. Yeah, that's kind of the thing. You only encounter this merc group once in Elliewood mode, and you end up fighting Uba Ubans at that point. You know, at that point, so it's like, huh, that's neat. I don't know. It's, he's famed for surprise attacks and lightning swift strikes. I mean, hmm. This could be interesting. Protect the throne. We will not lose the castle. Yeah, I don't know why the throne is like the, th the goal, but, you know, at the same time, it's like, hey, cool, now the enemy's in the position I tend to be in. I guess, sealing. Is that you, Heath? I've secured his retreat path as compan as Commander Yuban's orb. Just in case something goes wrong. I don't need you to tell me when to retreat. If we lose the element of surprise, we'll fall back. I've heard there are Ostian knights among the enemy forces. Ooh, very scary. Watch yourself, Seelan. Are we friends now? Worrying so about a complete stranger. Heath, you weren't meant to be a mercenary. And he's just saying don't die. Alright, so this chapter is... I like this chapter. I like defend chapters generally. Except Battle Before Dawn, but I'm not... I'm gonna get to that. Um, anyways, I will, I will be, I'm going to pause the video here till I get my preps ready. Alrighty, I'm back. Um, <laughs> so, uh, Seelan here will kindly explain the goal of this, what I got to deal with. Our goal is the throne. I mean, yeah, it is. It is the throne, I would assume. We'll attack from the front and send another unit behind. Okay, I mean, whatever. We want to drive the enemy into a state of chaos. The ambush units are concealed as ordered. Yay, ambush units. When enemy splits its forces, we strike. That's all. Go. Um, I think, like, reinforcements show up if I leave the throne room or something like it. 
Mustard. <laughs> if the goal is to defend, knights are your best hope. Too bad there's only one of me, huh? We can use our thick armor to form a living shield. I await your orders, Mustard. I actually do plan on taking advantage of that. Uh, I'm going to have... Um, first thing I'm going to do is have odds when you go over here. The Merc's going to use his turn to open the door, and then the, um, and the Mage is going to attack Oswin. It's going to hurt, but he can take it like a champ. Um, yeah. Um, as for sealing, just because it's a defend chapter doesn't mean I'm going to do sit here and do nothing. Um... Because Seelan has a dragon shield that he drop it that he drops, and it'd be really nice if I had that dragon shield. You know that'd be pretty neat. Um, also, there's treasure here. I forget. I know one of them has a silver axe, which is real nice, but I forget what the other one has. Anyways, there's a thief here, but hey, I got my own thief. I should have checked if I had a door key. I don't think I I don't think I have any door keys anyhow. So um, I'm gonna start by unlocking this door. Um, ah, that's fine. I was gonna have Hector. Come over here and deal with um, these guys, anyhow. Da, 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 da. Yeah. Um, does Ellie want to do like any damage? Okay, good. I was wondering if he did. Ah, uh, dag nabbit. Ellie can take one one hit, but not two. Nah, I know how to... I can have Ellie Wood go here, get the rapier ready. Well, I mean, I guess I won't have Mark... I can't have Marcus bait them yet, because I need him to protect Ellie Wood. Yeah, there we go. Ugh, Okay. Well, it might work, it might not. We'll find out, I guess. Uh. Hmm, can... I wonder, can, um... Urk take a hit? From, um... Let's see, I'll equip fire so he doesn't get weighed down. Mm. Let's see, 6, 12. I mean, he should be fine, I guess. As expected, they're going straight for Elliewood. Don't you dare crit. I just realized if he crits, this could really screw things up. <laughs> I think he could. I think he might die anyways to the to the javelin, which is honestly would be kind of hilarious considering this is turn one. Going straight for Marcus. Hey, fine by me. I just want Elliewood to not die. Come on, Oswin. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> Ellie Good the Liability, the sequel. 
Okay, okay. We're gonna need to do some changes around here. I overestimated Ellie Wood a bit, clearly. Actually, here's something I just thought of. Um, well, first of all, can Loan even one round the soldier? Because I do have to ask that, apparently. I mean, he definitely doubles. Seven, um, 14. So, yeah, it's an exact kill. That's so there's that accomplished. Now the question is Will he die um, from all three of these guys? A oof eighteen. So he'll take nine from the knight. Um He'll take four from the soldier, and he'll take five from this soldier. So, oh, cool. Yeah, he's fine. So yeah, just gonna... Okay, I made some miscalculations, it would appear. I'm on now. <laughs> Come on now, really? Wait, man, I'm a... What if I literally just... I mean, I could kill him and then... Surely... Elliewood can take one hit from Seelin. I mean, right? I forgot to move Sarah. Hmm. Hold on, if I were to go here... You know what, I, I'm, you know what, I realize I could just, yeah, I could have Marcus just simply s stick around here, do some chip, and then Ellie Wood can, can kill him off while Marcus deals with Seal in next turn. Alrighty. Well, now we got that out of the way. Um, oh yeah, I got Priscilla here too. I created her end of last chapter. Good unit. She heals. She has Kanto. 
So, yeah. There we go. Um, wait, hold on. Why would I attack the wall? I'm not going to attack the dang wall. I didn't have any javelins to, uh, to give them. Hmm. Is he gonna take? Oh. Ten. Okay, that's no problem. What do these guys have? Okay. How many enemies are there, anyhow? Oh. Uh, let's see, yeah. Sorry. Checking. I was checking the objective, I guess. Yeah, Matthew can. Matthew will live a turn. Um. All right. Yep, here it comes. I'll meet any challenges here. Someone else go after the throne. I mean, it's unlikely, but he. But I'm sure he'll say this even if all of his friends are dead. Surely he doesn't double. I didn't check, but okay, good, 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 good. And yeah, Ceylon's been baited. Dun, 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 dun. Oh yeah, I gave Hector an iron axe finally, so he wouldn't chew through the wolf veil. Cause it's looking rough. Okay, yeah, there we go. Wah, wah. Well, you tried. Love the hand axe, it's good. I don't have very much confidence in Ellie Wood to hold the dang choke point, so I'm gonna have to figure this out. Okay, how to do this? Oh, come on, Irk. Work with me here. Not quite. Um. Yeah, Javelin's probably the best choice here. Uh, 
Dag nabbit, he doesn't even kill. Marcus is a bad unit. Anyways, get rid of the knight. I would say flare. <laughs> yeah, it'll work. And death. Let's heal up Matthew. Um, maybe I should have given the Marcus's javelin to um, Lowen. good here and um, uh, well let's see if I move here okay so he'll probably go for ceiling will probably go for Marcus if I get able to safety which is what I want I want I do not want him going for Oswin that would really suck Just can't safely attack him, though. Oh no, I wasn't paying enough attention. Okay, I'm just gonna have to hope Lowen doesn't die. It should be fine, like. He can take two hits. Uh, not sure about three, though. Yeah, sure. I'll I'll chip him down. I'll actually use Marcus. I'll, I'll actually use him like I would a Jagan, because apparently he's supposed to be a Jagan. It's a little risky, I think. Um, let's see if he gets hit by this knight as well. Okay, good. I think he would have been fine, maybe, but still, better safe than sorry. Well, that wasn't safe, that's kind of the point. Wah, wah. Uh. 
Well, I'm glad Marcus is taking care of the mage. Mages can be a little, can be a tad annoying because of the magic. Well, I mean, who knows? Maybe it's, maybe it's just my FE6 brain talking. Nice. Heh! <laughs> Eh, yeah, that's alright. And we get to take care of... Okay, nah, he's too speedy for Marcus to double. Okay, I get it. Oh boy, more of them. It would be hilarious if these guys moved first and then this guy. That would be great, but eh, I don't know. The likelihood of that happening. Okay, only one of them has a hand axe, so. Yeah, Lowen could take him. Lowen could. could uh, hold a choke point, I would say. I think I'll let Ellie Good take this kill. Um, before I do that, I want to plan. I want to actually plan. I know, shocking. I want to get Matthew over to that thief, too. Which is fine. It shouldn't be too big of a deal. Da, 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 da. Ooh, hey, hold on. Um, okay, yeah, that works. Nice. I want to get Matthew's speed up um, for a guiding ring because I don't, I don't know how speedy Heinz, Heinz will be. Um, I mean, for all I know, he's probably fine now. Maybe you just need one more point of speed or something. I don't know. All I know is that at base, it just doesn't work. Or so, apparently. Ah, oh, come on now. Nice. <clears throat> Yeah, yeah that, that support from Hector might have helped. I'd say that helped. It gives, gives Ellie Wood a bit of a void, which doesn't really apply at the moment, but it can. Oh, wait. Uh, no. That's really shaky and unreliable. I don't want to rely on these guys moving first, cause, well, wait a minute. <laughs> I just realized it would be nice to choke this point, but even if I can't, they can't reach the. Th wait, no. Hold um, I don't think hand axe guy moves first, but if he does, then yeah, he'll reach the throne, and that's it. But if this guy, if if any other of these guys move first, then they can't get to the throne this turn. That they would be flooding the throne room, which would which would really suck to deal with. No, let me. Oh come on now! Uh... Yeah, that's fine. I mean, everybody here has a good amount of health, I'd say. 
Hector, don't miss. Well, okay, that helps. <laughs> Um, hmm, could I, can I use the iron blade? I mean, I think it only gets weighed down by, uh, it gets weighed down by two, not one. Um, so he'd have five AS. I mean, he's not doubling anyway, so might as well train his sword rank, I guess. Starting with this wall, I suppose. Alright, just heal Lowen. Yeah. And bam. Nice. Ceiling's probably going to attack from here, here, or here. Which I hate. I don't want. It. I don't want any of those spots. I'd rather he attack from like here, cause you know he's definitely gonna use the longbow for sure. Oz win the boss win. Seriously, imagine being a good knight, like a good knight in a GBA game. Sarah can't really do anything this turn. Not sa not safely anyways. Yeah. Yeah, that's about what I expected. That's fine. I can still loop around with Marcus and kill him that way. And since he didn't kill that guy, um, that chokes this point. Hand axe guy doesn't even get the chance to attack because, yeah, everybody's dumb. Everybody's an idiot. That's fine. Hit rate's probably awful, yep. Okay, how to handle the... Let's see. Dang. All right. 
I mean, I can let the thief steal stuff and then kill him. Hey, hey, hey! Oh my god, he is not getting good level ups. Luck is nice, well, kinda nice, but I don't know. In defense, I don't. Come on, come on now. Ugh, so many swords. Uh, that's fine. It's, they're not exactly going to dent Hector anyways. Nice. Alrighty. Nine and let's yeah. No, that'll leave I'll leave him three HP okay, I thought I would leave him with two. Guess I was wrong. I guess I was wrong. Um, if Matthew goes here, no. I'm mean, fine, whatever. I can deal. But no, I want to kill the archer anyways because of the. That's fine. I can I can rob him blind at later. Oh come on, come on, eh? Okay, three defense. Okay, yeah, he's fine. Um, I mean, yeah, it's all I can really do, I guess. Alrighty. Ah, no speed. Um, I gotta heal Marcus now, right? Oof, yeah, definitely gotta heal him. Um, eight, nine, ten, thirteen, ten. Does she get doubled? No, she does not. Alrighty. And that's it. Okay. That's not a that's a pretty good spot for sealing to be, I'd say. Yeah, I can just I can kill him with a hand axe or something. In fact, I might be able in fact, I might be able to uh, give the kill to someone other than Marcus, potentially. That'd be nice. Uh, no, still, 
Still not getting attacked by the hand axe this turn. Well. Come on, Hector. Aw. Eh, yeah, well. Oh my god. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna attack him at two range now. Those guys are in the way. Uh, what's the stats on the silver? Ooh, that's pretty good. Alrighty. Don't mind if I do. Ah, oh, come on. You don't gotta be like that, huh? <laughs> come on. <sighs> okay, screw it. I'll give it to Marcus. Yeah, I'll do. I'll give it to Marcus. So this is a mercenary's death. I mean, yeah. Ugh. I mean... I mean, I guess I can't complain too much. He did get he did get speed um, last video, if I recall correctly. Oh, I'm so glad I can use um, use stat boosters in the prep screen. I'm so glad, cause um, I am used to um, being forced. I'm used to binding blades, like being used to la 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 la, being forced to. Um, this crap on the battlefield or whatever. Oh, come on, Eric. You don't gotta be that way. I mean, whatever. More, more experience towards Kenneth, I guess. That ain't a bad level up. Ah, Javelin. Okay, that's fun. I don't I don't know if there are any more sport sportsmen's reinforcements are gonna come but actually I'm gonna want to yeah I do want to send Ellie Wood down here to assist um, Matthew thankfully the thief can't steal weapons so Wait a minute, the thief can't steal weapons. That means I can't steal the silver axe from him. Oh my god, and the other chest has money in it. Well, I mean, I guess it's not that big a deal, but... Um... Yeah, rip gold. Thankfully, he'll drop the silver axe as soon as I kill him, and I can, I can steal a lockpick on top of that. Um, 
Nah, I'm just gonna go for it. Ah. Bah, humbug. Yeah, I was just curious. I mean, no reason not to use the Iron Lance anyways. Yay! Lowen is doing really good. Really? You don't double the hammer guy? Uh, well, I mean, he's being weighed down by the Iron Blade, I guess, but... Alrighty. Why did he attack with the lance? I just realized. He could have attacked with the sword, but he had to pick the dang lance. Is it because the sword would have done, like, no damage? Well, wait, hold on. The lance doesn't do any damage to him either, though. Why is... Why do he use the lance? Mint. Oh, I thought it was gold. Okay. Oh my god. Okay. Nice job, Matthew. Hmm. And just so he doesn't steal the lockpick, I'm going to trade away that. Okay, where's the hand axe? Oh, right there. Gotcha. Gotcha. I'm using Iron Blade because, you know, more weapon EXP. I need... I'd like some of that, please. Alrighty. If he misses the Merc, then so be it. I mean, I could have used a different weapon now that I think about it and then traded it up, up to the top of the inventory, but eh, I don't care that much. Alrighty. Oh, crap. Aw, oh, come on, really? <sighs> Fine, whatever. Hmm. The next guy might actually go for low. Well, it depends on if the other guys move first. Hand axe guy could go for. Nope, never mind. That. Now, now you're smart. Now you use the sword. Okay, there you go.
<laughs> this guy has a. Uh... Ah, they both have swords. Okay. Bull crap. Um, how much damage does Matthew take from the hand axe guy? Eight. Fif ooh, fifteen. How much does Ellie would do? Twelve. So I just simply need to hit him with Fire Tome. There we go. Rip Silver Axe. I was hoping to get that, but no. Guess not. I'm not resetting for it. It's not it sucks, but it doesn't suck that much. So that's a pretty good level up. Ah, uh, he's only level five still. Ugh. I mean, let's go for it. Let's see. What, you know, if he hits, he hits. And he hits. Hmm. That's the weakest I can do. Okay, fine, whatever. Let's just hit him with the sword. Alrighty. This chapter was pretty relax was fairly relaxing. He's still getting crap level ups. Classic Lowen. He might, oh god, he, Priscilla might be in range of the hand axe guy. I didn't pay enough attention. Uh, she should be fine regardless. Oh. Oh. Uh, dang. Kind, that was weird. That was, that was something. But hey, cool chapter. Anyways, yes! We survived! I guess you did. The rest of the enemy units have begun to retreat. It must be part of their plan. Half of them are already gone. Nah, that's just the corpses on the ground. Blast! You have to admire their efficiency, though. <laughs> yeah, super efficient. You bet. Ugh. Eubens is mercenaries. I won't forget this. And, like, whatever. We'll likely cross paths again someday. And there's the assassins I fought in Ostia. Hector? Is something wrong? No, nothing special. We simply have to tie in our belts and prepare. It appears we have more than one enemy. Oswin. We'll see to the castle defenses at once. Yeah, because they worked well last time. No, I grow weary of defending things. Let's get out of here. <laughs> 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 
I love how the mercs, you know, I guess, I love how the mercs are trying to drive them out of the castle. Then we defend the castle, and then Hector's like, nah, let's ditch the castle. <laughs> That's great. Nice consistency. Let's get out of here and pursue Marquez Laos. It's time to put him on the defense. Oh god, next chapter has Lynn. <clears throat> eh. Anyways, after repelling after repelling the mercenary forces of Ubans. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna keep doing the voice unless someone says otherwise. Hector prepares to mount the pursuit of Marquez Laos. Lord Darren is and his knights are with the in, are with the instigator of the rebellion, the en <laughs> the enigmatic effigy. Oh, ooh, spooky! Hector learns where the fugitives were traveling from Ostia's network of spies. However, this final destination still remains unknown. Just wandering around, you know. <coughs> blast, blast. Where on earth has that snake Darren gone? I doubt he's left Lycia yet, but... Hector, it's been five days. The death of Marquez Santaruz. Our attack on Laos Castle. Word of these things must have reached Lord Uther by now. And yet he, so he shows no sign of action. Why? I'm sure he has his reasons. My brother has other concerns tying his hands right now. Yeah, I mean, threat of, a threat of a full-on war, meh, whatever. What do you mean? It's burn. It's always burn. We've received disturbing reports over the past few months. King Desmond is behaving oddly. If he sees even the slightest crack in Lycia's defenses, we believe he'll invade with all of Burn's might behind him. Yeah, it only took 20 years for that to happen. You got another 20 years. Don't worry. My brother has only recently become Marquez, as well as head of the Lycian League. He can't allow another country to see any weakness or discord. He has to, he has to present the face of stability and strength, is that it? Yes. It seems every country has a spy working in Ostia right now. I mean, isn't Ostia itself known for its network of spies? I don't know. They all want to assess the new Marquez's temperament and skill. If they sense anything wrong, word will spread like wildfire. It's like the internets. Hector, you're the Marquez's brother. Would not being on his side be seen as something wrong? The Marquez's brother is a well-known lout. If I were a court, they'd sense something wrong. That's harsh. You're not too proud of that reputation, are you? Not in the least. Lord Hector. Lord Elliewood. What is it, Oswin? Have you heard something? Yes, my lord. A messenger from the east. Castle Kaelin has fallen to a surprise attack from Marquez Laos. Castle Kaelin? They've struck again. Lord Housen. Is he unharmed? My apologies, my lord. We have no word on Lord Housen or his granddaughter, the Lady Lindis. Oh no! That's... Oh well. I never imagined they would attack Kaelin. Lord Housen. Lindis. Lord Hector. What should we do? They might still be alive, right? There's only one thing we can do. Hector, come on, we gotta hurry. Oh no, we got, they're like in danger, no. Hey, it's the band of scrubs. Well, I mean, Kent and Sane aren't that bad. I mean, the Cavaliers, they gotta be good, right? Right? 
Milady, I've returned, and I have brought news. Lao's sol soldiers are get scattered from the castle to the edge of this forest. Yeah, don't you love chapters that have for that have forests surrounding the entire center of the map, so you have to move really slowly? There must be at least 50 soldiers. Dang, that's the enemy cap. They must be serious. Also, that's blatantly not true. Are you sure about this, milady? We barely escaped. Going back to the castle would mean almost certain death. This is Fire Emblem. We can get away with it. My grandfather is in the castle. I left the castle on his orders, but... I can't leave him in there alone. Oh no, I guess not, I suppose. I mean, you did... You did have, like, an entire... You know, you did have ten whole chapters dedicated to that quest to... You know... See your granddad and not let him die. The numbers we face. Rescuing Lord Hawson would be no easy task. I wonder if we can expect any, any reinforcements. I overheard some of the Laos soldiers talking. They claimed that Lord Elliewood invaded Laos and drove them out. Elliewood? Why would he attack Laos? It gets even more interesting. Ooh, tell me the juicy deets. <laughs> Just tell me the gossip for today. Not only did Marquez Laos abandon his castle, but he also left his son Eric behind when he fled here to Kalen. That's despicable. He abandoned his own son? Hey, what can I say? D Darren's a piece of shit. Comically so. But at least we know Ellie what is in Laos. We might be able to ask him for help. Assuming there were a way to contact him. If we were to avoid being caught, the best path would be through the forest. Shall I go? Yeah, just don't get seen like by anybody or else you're gonna die because you're a crappy archer. I suspect you're right. Horses cannot move well in woods. Thanks for the tutorial, I guess. It'll take you a while, but you can travel lightly. Ooh boy, it's... It's the character. I think Florin is like a fan favorite in this game or something like that, generally. I mean, I'm kind of indifferent. Anyways, Lady Lindis, I'll go. I can fly above the forest. I can be a louse faster than anyone else. Oh, by the way, there's a blister on this map. Florina? You can't do this on your own. It's not, it's not possible to fly over the dang forest. You were about to send an archer through the woods. Thanks to my time here, I'm no longer as as timid around men as I used to be. Oh yeah, that's the character trait that she had. And I've met Lord Elliewood before. I'm sure I can do this on my own. It'll be terribly dangerous. You understand, don't you? Yes, but... I promised myself I would become braver for you. I'm... I'm not the weak little Florina I used to be. Oh, it's cool, I guess. I'll be fine. Trust me. Immediately get shot down by <laughs> by an arrow. <laughs> Off I go. <laughs> You've convinced me. You've convinced me. The job's yours, Florida. Don't die. You must pro but you must promise me that you won't try anything impossible. Yeah. Okay. Yay. Did you hear our meek Florina? She sounded most forceful. Please. So beautiful. She's become a full-fledged Pegasus Knight. I mean, I guess. Yeah, she. Yes, she has. All for you, Lady Lindis. That's quite gallant. Uh, when we lived on the plains, I was always her protector. I know I shouldn't feel sad, and yet... Oh, wow. Pretty sentimental stuff, I guess. Commander Bocker. Nice name. Bok. Bocker. Bok. Anyway, it's Commander Bocker. There's something in the southern skies. Is that a Pegasus Knight? Where do you suppose she's going? 
It doesn't matter. We've been told not to let anyone out of Kaelin. Archers, advance. Bring her down. And I guess the ballista doesn't reach her. To reach last, I must go over the forest and fly north. <laughs> nice animation. She's, it's just it's just there to a portrait in the sky background. Then I'll have to... Wait, who are those people? They fly no banner, and yet... Ah, that man in the lead. It's Lord Elliewood. Nah, that's... Aren't you, don't you mean Hector? This is Hector mode. Yay, that's wonderful. I have to tell him where Lady Lindis is waiting. Oh, these cutscenes are getting longer and longer. I spotted the enemy. Why are their archers advancing? They're aiming at something up high. Lord Elliewood, look! Up there, a Pegasus Knight. <laughs> I can't get up. I love this... I love this, uh, this, uh, screenshot or whatever. Like, this frame. And everyone's all like, Arr! <laughs> Hector in the background, like, what the fuck? Lord Hollywood. Could it really be? Florina, is that you? Uh, I'm getting tired of this. Yes, I'm Lady Lindis's... Florina, fly lower. What? Oh, ah. Florina. Ooh. Can you, can you hear me? Those archers almost hit you. Thankfully your avoid is kinda decent. <laughs> You avoided the arrows, but you lost your balance and fell. That can happen? Dang. And yet, I'm not hurt. Somehow. I fell from such a height. What? You got lucky. I didn't. <laughs> <laughs> uh, by the way, Hector and Florina have a, have a support chain. You landed right on top of me. Oh. Hector saved you. I mean... I guess. I saved no one. I simply gave her someplace soft to land. A bale of hay could have done more than what I did. Eek! Oh, I'm so sorry. And yeah, they get, they get a support chain, I, apparently. You were lucky, Florina. If you had fallen on me, I couldn't have caught you. Well, to be fair, Hector didn't exactly catch you. He, You just kind of fell on him or your Pegasus either they fell one after the other I couldn't get out of the way my Pegasus too I'm so I'm true I don't know what to say oh yeah there's like a thing in lane mode where like where like some bandits got pissed at her because her Pegasus landed on them or something I am I no apology needed you do need to tell us why you're here however yes of, of course Oh, that he would. Lady Lindis is beyond that force. Finally! She's waiting for a chance to assault the castle. She's white? Ah, still, it's good to hear she's safe. She's fine. However, Lord hassan has been captured. He's still in the castle. I see. Let's go, then. Can we do the dang chapter? I know I could skip this cutscene, but, you know, gotta be cons consistent or whatever. Someone get up there and scour the area. I want to know if we brought down that Pegasus Knight. If she's still breathing, make her st- oh. Did you have to word it that way? My lord, to the west, we're under attack. It's the fairy and noble, Elliewood. But he's not flying a bander, how'd you tell- whatever. He's here, eh? Now's our chance to show Marquez Laos our loyalty. Our opponents are a motley band of fools. They're no match for us. And yet they took down Eric. Well, I mean, to be fair, Eric's kind of a wimp. Eh. Ugh, finally. Okay, be right back. Gotta do preps. I'm back. And, um... I'm gonna use the dragon shield on L.A. Wood just so he has some... a bit more survivability. I mean, I could have given it to Marcus to 
so you can take some more hits and like take even more heat in enemy phase that you know that could be good but and eh, still I'm tired of LA wood being the equivalent of wet tissue paper well no that's Lynn LA wood is just tissue paper Um, Florin is going to join me at the start of the chapter, which is nice. And Lindis' Legion is going to be over here. Anyways, I got a... Oof. Yeah. I just remembered um, how sti that Hector Harmo is known for being kind of stingy with its deployment slots. Okay, what are these guys got? Slim Lance, j ooh, Javelin. Iron Lance. Okay, so here is the plan. I think Merlin's tent will be like here. Uh, man. I think it depends on the mode. It's either here or here. Um, it's gotta watch out for this thief too, cause um, cause thieves can destroy villages apparently. Alrighty. Um. I don't know exactly where Florin is going to start at. <clears throat> Let's see, they got ah, swords. I'll put Marcus there, they got high movement. Um, and we will go with that, I suppose. Yay. Okay, he starts next to the man. <laughs> uh, me <-usted. laughs> Um, it's me, Florina. Yeah. It is. Um, I'm, I'm over here. Yeah. Oh, okay, uh, okay, I thought you'd... Uh, <laughs> what? <laughs> yes, you are over here, I guess. What about it? Anyways, Florina. Good unit, because, you know, she's a flyer. With some investment, she can be pretty good in combat, too. Oh, my God. I'm used to... I think, I think in FE6, Shauna's strength is, like, four. So, you know, I'm used to... Strength being, like, god-awful. Well, I mean, it's kind of bad here, too. Actually, no, it's, I mean, it's like, kind of whatever. I don't know. I forgot to give Hector's hand axe to uh, Bartray. Eh, whatever. <laughs> and Lindsay's scrubs are over, over here. Lynn, good unit. Just kidding, she's god awful. Um, Alrighty. Let's see, Iron Lance, Iron Sword, Iron Bow. Um, what's in this armory? 
Ooh, okay, okay. Yeah, I'm going shopping. Um... These pegs are gonna be annoying. Fun fact, even in the Japanese version of this game, where um, Will ha would have three times effectiveness against these Pegasus Knights, he still doesn't one-shot them. Apparently, anyways. Um... Eighteen, nineteen. I mean, he might. I don't know. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Give me, get the freaking gem, red gem, not red gem, blue gem. Alrighty, got time to buy some crap. Um Hmm I could use door keys Okay. So yeah, Lynn could go in the forest and then, um... Imagine not dub- imagine not consistently doubling. Well, I mean, to be fair, mercs are generally known for being fast. Oh, come on! Could you at least double these? <sighs> Whatever. I should have bought the... Uh, that's fine. I can work with this. Steel lands bad. Okay, I'll put floor into there, I guess. I love how Merlin this has a uh, skill. But hey, they didn't give him strength, so there's that, I guess. Hmm. 
Hmm. Yeah, sure, whatever. That'll work. Nice crit. Also, animations. Gotta turn them animations on. Good job. You failed. Go, Bartray! Bam. I only didn't use him last chapter cuz um cuz I uh he's he's going too powerful. You surely you understand, right? Doesn't even double. Well, I guess his knights are pretty fast, but I don't know. Well, they don't have steel lances. They have iron, but still whatever. Nice dodge. Alrighty. Oh, dang. <laughs> I mean, they are being weighed down by javelins. So. I keep forgetting to turn the animations on. Twelve. Oh, eight. Oh, come on, really? Oh, come on, I don't want to have to dodge tank. Please don't force me to dodge tank. Hmm. Dodge. There, that works. That does not work. Hmm. This could be dicey. How much damage will he take from... They're gonna go in the forest, which that sucks. Hmm. Huh. 
Hey, that works for me. Bop. What would yield more experience? Actually, the better question is... Mmm, okay. Now we're getting somewhere. A magic level up. I'm doing fine over on this side. I'm mostly worried about Linda. Lindis. Mostly worried about Lynn and her comrades. I can't have Florina attack. Yeah, cause someone has to visit the village. Dag nabbit. Fine, whatever. Maybe I should have just used this. Well, no. Sword of wind of. Iron Sword wouldn't have worked. I didn't pay attention to damage. I'm used to swords being more so much more accurate than lances that you that you can face weapon triangle cuz yeah, cuz FE6. Okay. You're all Kaelin Knights, are you not? Well... What? Lord Hassan's still in the castle? Oh. This was the before our daughter's wedding, but here... Please help Marquez, Kaelin. Our lord needs rescuing. Glad to know everyone likes him, I guess. Um, Priscilla can take one hit. Alrighty. Oh yeah, heal mode is a thing. Oh my god.
Kent gets double, but he's not going to take much damage, thankfully. Hey, <laughs> eh, whatever. I'll just kill you and take the. I guess I won't take it back. That's fine. Fourteen. Oh no, Lowen gets double. <laughs> nice. And that's the kill for Florine. Nice. I'm just gonna let Marcus do his thing with the, um,. Hand axe. Dun 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 dun. Sword, sword, sword. <laughs> All of them. Pegasus isn't moving. Or wait, it's no wait, she probably is and I just wasn't paying attention. How much damage is Lynn gonna take? Um, uh, eight, six, let's see. Plus weapon triangles. Nine, uh, fifteen. Oh, yep. Yeah. Okay. That's one way of going about it, I guess. Whoa. Hmm.
Okay, get rid of this guy, please. <sighs> Will, you suck. Okay, good. Satan might die anyway. Pegasus buzzed off at least, but it might be too late. Oh, come on. Oh, no. <laughs> That's it. He's finished. Hmm. Well. There it sucks. And I am going... I'm going to reset the chapter. Not because Will died. But because... Well, because of that too, I guess. Yeah. Um... I'm gonna call the video here, so, um, and next time I'll beat this dang chapter, and get my dang hand axes, see ya.